Hi guys! Welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, meron tayong random math problem galing from differential calculus na tinanong ng isa sa mga subscribers natin. So actually, this is under na implicit differentiation. So at, I think at this moment, medyo nalilito pa rin si Lodi KX. So tuturo ni Sir IJ pa paano ito gagawin. So ito yung tanong mga Lodi, find the equation of the tangent line to an ellipse with the equation x squared plus 3y squared minus x plus 2y is equal to 0 at the origin. So, ang ibig sabihin kasi ng equation ng tangent line, obviously, you need to get the slope. Paano ba natin kinukuha yung slope? The slope of the tangent line is equal to the derivative of the given equation. Kaya lang, kung mapapansin nyo, ang given natin is uh, an implicit function, meaning meron tayong x, y, and combination of x, y, mga lodi. So, kunyari, yung x naka-squared, yung y naka-squared. So, we will need to, we, we need to use implicit differentiation. Kasi diba, tandaan natin na ang concept ng slope that is equal to the first derivative mga idol. Since yung point natin is origin, 0, 0, ito yung gagamitin natin na point. Dun sa magiging value ng slope natin which is equal to dy over dx or that is just simply equal to y prime. So how do we differentiate? Pero first thing mga lodi, before kayo mag-differentiate kasi baka nagko-compute kayo ng derivative tapos hindi nyo naman tinit chinek na yung origin nagsasatisfy dun sa equation. Kasi kapag hindi siya nagsasatisfy dun sa equation, obviously, you will do another uh, I mean, ibang way ng pagsasolve. Kasi nga, hindi na siya rectangle ito kasi hindi naman siya magsasatisfy dun sa equation. Pero once na ma-verify mo mga, I mean, Lodi, na itong 0, 0 passes through the given point, obviously, you can directly perform the that the slope of the tangent line is just the first derivative of the function. Ganun siya. Okay? So, siguro, bibigay na lang si Sir IJ ng isang problem re regarding dun sa hindi mag, hindi tatama or it will not pass through the given point. So, paano natin to differentiate? So, meron tayong x squared. Ang derivative nito is 2x plus 3y squared. Ano derivative niyan? 6y y prime. Tandaan nyo yung mga lodi ha? kasi with respect to y so baba nung 2, 2 times 3 that's 6 y raised to 1 multiplied by y prime. Minus ano derivative ng x? That is 1 plus 2. Ano derivative ng y? That is y prime is equal to 0. So we need to combine all those na merong y prime. So meron tayong 6 y, y prime plus 2 y prime is equal to 1 minus 2x. So, in-isolate ko lahat ng y prime dun sa kaliwang side natin. Sa right side naman natin yung walang y prime. Ito nilipat ko sa kabila. Ito nilipat ko sa kabila. So, i-factor out natin yung y prime. That is 6y plus 2 equals 1 minus 2x. Therefore, it follows that y prime is equal to 1 minus 2x all over 6y plus 2. Sir IG, what does it imply? So, it implies that the slope of the tangent line at any point on the ellipse, ellipse is equal to 1 minus 2x all over 6y plus 2 in which x comma y is the point of tangency. Since x is 0, y is 0 kasi through the origin, so it follows that this is equal to the slope. So that is 1 minus 2 times 0 all over 6 times 0 plus 2. So this is cancel na kasi 0 na yan, 1 half. Therefore, the slope of the tangent line must be equal to 1 half. Tapos, naalala nyo pa ba yung equation or yung point slope form that is y minus y sub 1 is equal to m times x minus x sub 1. Sir IJ, bakit po natin need yan? Kasi we are looking for the equation of the tangent line. Given tayo ng slope, given tayo ng point, so you, we can use the point slope form. of Or if you can use other uh, forms. Pero ang pinaka-specific or pinaka-best method na gamitin dito is ito na. Kasi diretso na yung point, pati slope. So, ano y sub 1 natin? x sub 1, that is 0, 0. y minus 0 is equal to 1 half multiplied by x minus 0. So, this will be y is equal to 1 of x. For kapag sinimplify natin, that is 2y is equal to x. Gawin natin general form. x minus 2y is equal to 0. So, ito na yung final answer natin. Or you can answer as well y equals 1 of x. So, wala, kung wala namang sinabing form yung prof mo, so, much, I mean, any answers will do pwedeng standard form, Pwedeng general form, pwedeng slope intercept form. Okay mga Lodi? So napaka simple lang yun, ba? So just in case, meron kayong gustong itanong or questions regarding the problem or any other math problem, so okay mahiyo mag-comment sa comment section and I'll try my best to answer uh, those questions through my YouTube channel and my videos. So salamat mga Lodi sa patuloy na sumusupport sa channel natin and pagpalain kay Lord. 
And hopefully mga Lodi, please subscribe din sa mother ko, Mary Ann Maling. So yung uh, vlog niya is more on cooking and yung kulay orange na profile. So support nyo rin yung mother ko uh, na makarit siya ng 1,000 subscribers. So ayun mga Lodi, keep safe na lang, especially pandemic. Mag-focus kayo sa mga goals nyo and I'm praying for all the best sa inyong lahat. See you on my next Smart Tutorial video and bye-bye!